Hello and welcome. My name is Amul and we are watching TubeMint. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install Go Ethereum or Geth on Windows 10. So go ahead and launch your preferred web browser and use your preferred search engine. You can simply type Geth Lab or you can type Geth Go Ethereum and then go to the website which is get.ethereum.org and you can download get from by clicking this button over on the right tab and then choose your operating system but this is windows 10 so i'm going to click on for windows and you should download it okay so I already have downloaded it, so I'm going to cancel it. So go ahead and locate your download folder wherever your get is installed. And it is an exe file, so you just have to double click on it. And it should give you this windows protection affected your PC. Click on more, run it anyway. It is, um, okay. It's, it's a good and reliable source so this is basically going to launch it you will have to say yes on the UAC box and make sure you read the license agreement and click I agree uh, get into development mode so go ahead and uh, check that box and say next so this is it is going to be installed what I'm going to do I'm going to copy it because we need to keep put it on the environment variable if it is not recognized okay so this is going to take okay so done path not updated original length is okay so what we need to do we simply have to go to update the path and we can do that so this is just trying to ebm.exe chef.exe clef not chef okay so in the meanwhile what we can do complete it now if you go ahead and launch say get it shouldn't uh, let's see it is not recognized so we need to go ahead and get the variable edit system variable environment variable environment variables go to system variables and select it and say edit add a new and you simply put this slash so everything within that folder so let's see how it's been basically built up so go to get here it is and everything is there so it's going to be we uh, can run get evm clef boot node okay so now if i go ahead and relaunch it and type get it should be able to you can see we got all the information and when it's different firewall i'm going to cancel it so this has been installed uh, depending on your requirement you can use this tool now you can simply close it by pressing Ctrl D and that's been closed. Alright, so that's it for the video. Thank you for watching. Bye.